Do when I ride a bumble. It's fake hills. One time, one time, one time. Good morning babies. Today I have a box spray unit from the company Beauty Sparks. Here's what the packaging looks like. It also comes with a stocking cap. Now I requested 20 inches for the length so it's pretty long. Here is the baby hairs and the 13 by 6 lace and the adjustable strap. And there are no cones. So let's just get this baby on right quick y'all. Now she is a little heavy due to the amount of braids that's on the unit. So I kind of feel like it's slightly weighing my head down and it almost makes the wig feel like it's sliding back on my head. So hopefully I can put this baby on right. <laughs> now you can see those knots just a little bit y'all, but due to the stocking cap that I'm wearing, I may can get away from bleaching those knots. Um, I won't be applying any type of pressed powder or foundation on this unit at all this time. I'm just gonna, you know, just wear it natural as is with the stocking cap and I'm gonna see how that works for me. So now we're gonna go ahead and go in with the got to be glue spray. I'm gonna actually spray it on top of the lace this time, y'all, before I cut the lace. And then I'm gonna take my baby hairs down because I don't wanna make it to the point where I don't have enough lace on the baby hairs to work with because that's gonna make my unit slide back even more, if that makes sense. <laughs> even though I'm spraying the got to be glued and I'm drying it and stuff like that, I still feel like braided units always make my head weigh down for some reason so this is just the way that i'm gonna do it this time y'all and lord knows i don't know why i got these big old scissors y'all but i couldn't find my other ones so y'all just gotta bear with me because i'm trying to cut this lace right and it is really not cutting right right now <laughs> Okay now, so it's time to work with these baby hairs. Now I am gonna go in and tweeze them a little bit because I just feel like that's just too much. And they are a little tab thick. So I am gonna do a little bit of tweezing y'all and I am gonna cut them shorter than what they are. So hopefully y'all pray for me that I don't mess these baby hairs up y'all. Cause like I tell y'all all the time, I'm always making my baby hairs either too thick or I may not have enough. So I'm just gonna try to work some out, child, and try to do the best I can. Y'all don't talk about me too, too bad, y'all. Please don't, girl, because I just have a hard time doing my braided unit baby hairs for some reason. So I'm gonna try to do the best I can, and hopefully they don't be all over the place, but um, if they are, I guess y'all can go ahead and laugh at a sister, <laughs> okay? <laughs>
So I guess y'all, this looks okay. But I am really not feeling these baby hairs at all. I just, I don't know y'all. They just don't look right for some reason to me. But overall, the braids are really nice. I love how natural they look. They do look like they're growing from out of my scab though. And that's the look that I am definitely going for when, you know, wearing these type of braids. I am going to try to do like a couple of, you know, different styles for y'all right quick. And I'm just going to come up with something, maybe a cute little bun, or I may just do like a cute little, you know, um, ponytail, just a mid, you know, ponytail right in the middle. And I am definitely feeling this unit, y'all. The price of her, she was $135 on the site and I will put the links and everything you guys need to know about this unit if you guys want to purchase and that's pretty much it babies so if you guys have any more questions just jot them down in my comment section and I will try my best to answer any type of questions for y'all and uh, y'all just keep it safe out there I love y'all and just know that Miss Candy Poop is always praying for you guys and I'm going to finish up some of these styles, y'all. And I'm going to talk to you babies a little bit later. Okay? Later, babes. <laughs>